Oh man, this year. <laughs> the first street event of 2020, because of the fires going on out there, they canceled the street league event. The LA Times is reporting Kobe Bryant has been killed in a helicopter crash. The Peru Bowl sunk into the ground. A big chunk of the uncertainty for all of us looking forward to Tokyo 2020 was eliminated this morning. We begin with breaking news in South Minneapolis. A man is dead after an encounter with police. Firefighters are working to protect these homes from the flames in what has been a historic wildfire season. Coronavirus is rampaging through the country. We are following breaking news at this hour. Capitol Hill right now. We want to go to live images. It is unclear if Capitol Police are outnumbered. The points that everybody earned are valid up to this point. Our assumption is that if any more qualifying events happen, those will add on to those totals and have an impact on who gets to go to the games. This year we had to shift to a virtual video for the opening quarterfinals and semifinals round. Then we're gonna do in-person finals. There have been some virtual video competitions, but none have been for Olympic qualifying points. Do a kid 2021 USA National Championships run. Welcome everyone to the 2021 USA Skateboarding National Championships presented by Toyota. Finals night fueled by Got Milk. This is our first Olympic qualifier on United States soil since 2019. It is 2021 and we've got some great skateboarding ahead of us. That's right and tonight we will officially crown our 2021 USA National Champions for all disciplines, men and women's, park and street. Before we get into it though, we wanna say thank you so much to all of our sponsors, Toyota, Got Milk, Nike SB, Tech Deck, Jessup Grip Tape, ProTech Helmets, and California Skate Park's training facility. Let's get into some great skateboarding. Tonight's event was pre-recorded at the Barracks Skate Park in downtown Los Angeles and California Training Facility in Vista, California. Sometimes we're so focused on the destination that we forget to praise those who are with us on this journey. From the first stroke in the water to the final stretch towards the finish line. From the drills at sunrise to the restless drop of sweat at twilight. We are not moving alone. And never will be. So this year is their year. We will run, swim, fight, ride, fall, rise, move, just for them. Because we move as one. Welcome back everyone to the 2021 USA Skateboarding National Championships presented by Toyota, the finals fueled by Got Milk. As you all know by now, because of the COVID-19 pandemic, we had to switch gears and go to our first ever virtual national championship qualifying event. The qualifying quarterfinals and semifinals rounds were all conducted via social media. The digital format actually really opened this up in such a cool way. It made it so that skateboarders from all over the United States were able to compete. So here we are tonight. It all culminates here at the finals. Let's take a look back at just a few of the entries that we saw along the way. It was so awesome to see the variety of different skating from the age groups, disciplines, and the regions from all over the United States. But when it all came down to it, our World Skate certified judges were able to narrow it down to the top eight for each discipline, with Jordan Santana from Houston, Texas leading Women's Park, Liam Pace from Oceanside, California leading Men's Park, Mariah Duran from Albuquerque leading Women's Street, and Deshaun Jordan from Chino, California leading Men's Street. 
There was a lot of amazing skating, but we definitely want to shout out some honorable mentions. These skaters put together amazing runs, but they didn't quite make the cut. We look forward to seeing a lot more of you in the years to come. ready to crown our champions, but before that, let's take a look at the contest format. In the street, we've got two runs, they're 45 seconds each, then we've got five best trick attempts, and we're gonna be taking the top four scores overall. When we get into park, we've got three 45 second runs, and it's all about your best run. World Skate judging is based off of five key points. Difficulty and variety of tricks, quality of execution, use of the course, flow, and consistency and repetition. We're gonna be beginning today's event with Women's Street, and who better to give us a course preview than our very own Mariah Duran. What up? Mariah Duran here at the Barracks. We're gonna look at the street course for the Nationals contest. Here we got the 10 rail, fresh paint. Looks very nice and clean for us. Five stair, double hubbas, freshly painted as well. This next feature was really sick. I was excited to skate this one. It's like the eyeball, Euro kind of thing. The five stair, rail, square. These are brand new. Never seen these until today. Not even on the Instagram, so. <laughs> Damn, this one's really sick. Let's go. I didn't actually look at that until just now. And then over here, we got the classic seven rails, out ledge, box, manny thing. Definitely new, for sure. See the fresh paint on it. Over there, we got the A-frame, quarter pipes for the flow. Looks like we got a red curb on the course as well, if you really street. <laughs> Manny pad, ledge. We got the three stair. I wonder if the dudes are gonna hit these hubbas. Yeah, I wanna see them skate it. Of course, we got the hip right here. Kinda launches out. That's it, downtown Los Angeles at the barracks. We'll see uh, what kind of skating goes down this weekend. Stay tuned. Thanks, Mariah. And without further ado, here are your Women's Street finalists. Our 2019 national champion, Mariah Duran, is currently in the lead, but Samaria is right on her tail. This should be interesting. This is gonna be so much fun to watch. Let's take a quick break, and when we come back, we're gonna kick off the women's finals. Welcome back to the 2021 USA Skateboarding National Championships presented by Toyota. Finals night fueled by Got Milk. Let's kick this thing off with our first skater, Selena Meehan. Selena Meehan, and I'm from Landing, New Jersey. I think if I was the USA National Champion, my mind would just be blown. <laughs> Selena is on course. Nice front rock. Coming out of Jersey now, living in Philly. You know I back that. Love to see the nollie down the stairs right there. That's red. That was solid. Good start. Ah, slide down on that spin drive. Selena got right onto the course as soon as the door is open. She wants it. Because I want to see that switch up in that next run. Yeah, let's 
Let's talk the format for our viewers here. So basically what we've got is two 45 second runs, five best trick attempts, and then we take the top four highest scores overall. Exactly, exactly. 12.87 on run number one. Jamie Crutcher from Miami, Florida. I decided to skate this contest because barracks is a big deal. They're all ripping out there, but I'm feeling good. Next skater in is Jamie Kutcher, coming out of Florida. I'm Megan Guy and I'm from Palm Bay, Florida. I'm gonna go skate, have a good time, see my friends, try to be a little strategic, and I think I'm winning by being here, to be honest, regardless of what place I end up in. Megan Guy is in. Megan Guy on course. Megan Guy, nice and possible. She's off to a great start. She's got a lot of confidence. Nice board slide. Megan is shredding right now. Yeah, she has been skating in contest. She knows exactly how to do it. Nice 180 up the step up there. Five seconds on the clock. Oh. Going for the flip. All right, so Megan is in with a 19.51. Left. My name's Paige Hine and I'm from Chandler, Arizona. To be named the U.S. National Champion, that would be pretty crazy. A lot of opportunities to come from that. Paige Hine, coming out of Arizona. Pascal from Montrose, New York. I decided to skate this contest to push myself and meet new people. To win, it would be crazy. Jordan Pascal, I was watching her shred practice. She had that crooked grind every single time. She rips. My name is Poe Penson. I'm from Fernandina Beach, Florida. 
to win. I feel like that'd be really cool to tell people, to be able to tell people that I won. We got Poe Pinson. Poe is a shredder. I'm looking forward to this. Setting it off with that back 50 on the round round. Very solid. Nice board slide. Into a no slide. Up to a great start. So smooth. The back 50s, that is really hard on a round round. Poe just skates with <laughs> such authority. Like, super oh, young, nice but out, like, looks like a vet out there. Just so comfortable. Look at that backside 360. Wow. Now that's a run. Our first uh, complete run in the books right there for Poe Pinson. Can't wait to see Man, the scores. first run right there for Poe. She's got a 40.93. She is a good 20 plus points ahead of Megan Guy. That's a huge score. That's a, that's a big jump. My name's Samaria Brevard and I'm from Riverside, California. You know, just another chance to get a little extra points to kind of help my score, so I'm meant to be here. <laughs> Samaria Rivard. Samaria has been absolutely on fire in this year off from competition. Nice 50. Oh! 360 flip. We watched her do that every time in practice. She's got plenty of time. Yeah, and Samaria and Mariah were a good 20 points ahead of the other competitors coming into this competition. There you see a solid Smith grind on the flat bar. Now we know why. Oh, the big spin getting away from her. Like just centimeters away from I know. Base. It's like it breaks your heart. <laughs> oh, I like it. Yes! Nice run 5 0. Oh. That was still a solid run. Scores in 24.43 for Samaria. Puts her in second place right now, but we've got Mariah Duran. Uh, Mariah Duran from Albuquerque, New Mexico. I think I'm just trying to prove that I'm so much better than the person I was in 2019. I'm just going to go out there, do my best, and try to execute everything I came out here to do. Yes, our 2019 National Women's Street Champion. I'm so excited to see what Mariah brings to the course. Nice lip slide. First one we've seen today to the back 50. She's got so much poise and control. It's like an authority, like stomped that back 50-50. A lot of speed. Solid kick flip up to step up. Every trick she does, she just makes it look like so seamless and perfect. Really good stairs. style. So ground. comfortable, yeah, it's amazing. And Mariah's score is in, 51.36. She is a full 10 points plus above Bo Pinson. Selena right. Mihan Selena coming in next. In. We're back that? to the top of the order in the run section. I like the front rock there. Solid Nolly once again. Coming in at the ledge. Got to make the Smith grind. Oh. Oh. Honestly, that's, that. that's risky business <laughs> on a ledge during your run. With a ton of wax and metal. A lot of, a lot of room for error in that one. Definitely. Got 15, 15 seconds. seconds on the clock. Let's see this one. There we go. Come on, let's see the right, switch please. flip. Run number two. Yeah. 
Run number two is in 15.74. Has Selena in third place overall. Jamie Kutcher is in for her second run. Coming at the Jamie stairs. Trying to improve on her first oh, score. 360 flip. Ah, just got away from her. I appreciate the risk taking. Yeah. Yeah, I love uh, I love when people start their, their run off with a flip trick. It's never easy. Get him, Jamie. Wow, oh, missing going it this time. For it. That's the risk when you go back and retry a trick. You only got 45 seconds. This is a huge course. Yeah, this is. There's a lot of opportunity in here, but there's also a lot of space. A lot, lot of opportunity for lost time. So, so yeah. that is time right there for Jamie on run number two. Next Megan skater Guy. in, yes. Megan Guy on course. Nice manual, start things off. Into the impossible again. Oh, not only disaster, nose to disaster. Gets a little twisted up there. Plenty of time, plenty of time. Let's see it. Nice board slide. I love the switch boneless. That one's such a wild move. <laughs> Shows that body, body burial hurricane. Carving around that corner, coming up with a lot of speed right here. Five seconds, let's see what you've got. Oh, nice kick flip. Big kick flip. Up the step up. And with a bang. Nice, Megan. So score at 21.17. It is an upgrade. Yeah, that puts her in third place so far. Next skater in, Paige Hine from Arizona. Get him, Paige. Nice yeah. kick flip over the head. Paige is a total ATV, can skate everything. Nice blunt fakie. So, so far, a great improvement on our first run. Oh, a cap I love that. I like a cap. It. Over the bump to bump. Into a yes. switch flip. We'll take it. We that was awesome. It. Ollie it up. Into the yes, 5082. This is Very great. Nice. Yeah, Paige. 15 I seconds appreciate on the, the clock. hustle, too. Big flip forward. Yes. Dude, second improvement on the first run. There's that 50 50. Uh, overall, yeah. solid second run from Paige. Hopefully, put her in the top three. We'll see. Scores in. Paige, 19.51, brings her up. She's in fourth place with a 34.97. And next skater in, we've got Jordan Pascal. Trying to reset from that first run. There's the crook. Super and drive. good crook. I love the speed. Ah, the even grind got away from her. Hustle it. She's got 15 seconds. Let's see if she can make one last trick here. At least. Again, that's the problem with the barracks, man. It is a big part. Dang, you're going running for out it right time. there on the rail, though. 11.71 moves her up into seven. Bad. Okay. Next in, Pope Hinton. Poe putting down that impressive 40.93. Yeah. Still oh, holding uh, second place with only a single one score. score. Yeah, it's insane. Look at the speed she's got right here. I did not expect that. Ah. Nice curve dance. A nice coping dance into a solid kickflip. Into the board slide down the big rail. Oh, is killing it right now. 50 50 to fakie. Wow, go for that switch 360. Still an amazing run so far. A little time left. 15 on the clock. Get him, Poe. Backboard fakie. Oh, yes! Hanging on to the sky. 
Now in first place for the 68.63. All right, Samaria Brevard, though. Now on course. Nice. Currently Big down in sixth place. Oh! oh. foot gets away from her again. Nice high speed Smith grind. I love the recovery. The confidence it's, for a high-speed Smith grind, you have to be so ready to go. It's awesome. Ah, uh, the big thing gets away from her. Ten seconds left on the clock for Samaria. Uh, so Samaria is going to have to count on those five best trick, trick attempts. That, though, is where Samaria shines. Because sure. she goes for it. She's super gnarly. It is definitely not over. Last skater in our run section, Mariah Duran. That lip slide, perfect every time. Into the back 50. Mariah wasting no time at all. Get lots of speed. Up the step up. Very cleanly done. 20 seconds on the clock. Get him, Mariah. That front forward. To kick off best trick, we're gonna set things off with Selena Meehan. Coming in for some transition. Oh, going for the front side there. Over the hip there. So we got two runs and five best trick attempts, all scored zero to 100, and we are taking the top four overall scores. Next skater in is gonna be Jamie Kutcher. For us. Oh, she had the back foot yeah. on. She's got four more attempts to try to clean up her scores so far. Man, this is and, all right, and we are waiting for Megan Guy. She's in. Right. Slide down the big rail. That's strategy at play right there. Yeah. Can't we know she can board move. slide that. We saw it in the runs, but that's also going to get her some points. Yeah, Megan currently in fourth, so yeah, you're, you're right. She's playing the numbers right now. Scores in 10.46. That moves Megan up into third place, pushing Samaria down into fourth. Next skater in, we got Paige Hine. Get him, Paige. Oh, coming Skate in. Upstairs. It looks like Switch. Yeah, yeah Ollie. Switch Ollie down the wow. steps. Smooth. That was rad. She's still super young and you know relatively small. Like just wait until she gets a little more power. Yeah, that's a big set of stairs. I'm excited to see where the judges go score-wise on this one. Oh, and it moves her up a spot. She's got a 9.45. Alright. Alright, a little improvement there. She's now in fourth. Next skater in Jordan Pascal. Going for that I love it. Yes. Missed that in the run. Got it there in the best trick. Very, very well done there, Jordan. Next skater in is going to be Pope Hinson. Such a deep, interesting bag of tricks. She's going for the big set. Let's see what she's got here. Back oh! 50. 50. All right. Into a little backside area. I wish we could count that. That was that super was casual. And look at that look score. At that. 24.74. Now closing that gap between her and Mariah. 105.78 yeah. is the score to beat. Samaria Brevard on course for her first attempt. Crooked grind. Strategy. Playing it smart. Down. Crooked grind's a tough one, but not for Samaria. <laughs> Front feeble. First attempt. 
in the judges saw it, so it will count. But Mariah it scores in 33.83 wow. for that front feeble. So, woo. Wow, she yeah, she's almost 50 points ahead I mean, right now. Every score right now is <laughs> just top of the heap. Back to the top. Raya is killing it today. All right, back to the top of the order. Selena in. Let's see her make this. There it is. Yes, that was awesome. Solid frontside air over the head. Using her FDR transition skills there. Scores in 6.06 meter up to sixth place overall. Next skater in, Jamie Kutcher. Jamie had that 360 flip attempt on her last best trick. Let's see what she's got here. Looks like she's gonna go for it again. Ah, and really going for it. Yeah, seriously. Megan Guy on course, what she got? A kick flip. Ah, oh, I think she's going for a kick flip to manual. At least it's not a bail. And now 5.34. She's going to try to improve on that. Next skater in, Paige Hine. Oh, she's coming in switch. All right, switch front 180. 180. Down the five stair. Going switch again. I really love the switch ollie down the big set. Jordan Pascal. Oh! oh. Going Jordan. for the feeble down yeah. there. She was going for it, man. Next skater to drop in is going to be Poe Pinson. Oh, oh. Outside fakie. Oh, man. So I don't think that one's going to count. But, oh, front tail fakie is no joke yeah, on that rail. She, uh, that is awesome. Next skater in, Samaria Brevard. Samaria now in third place after two runs and a best trick attempt. This is where she really shines. I mean, honestly, you'd be hard pressed to bench. find a better 360 flip <laughs> anywhere. That was so good. So good. Mariah Duran on course. Oh, hard flip down the steps. Wow. That was so good. Oh, Mariah so is smooth, on man. fire today. I don't even think, has Mariah even fallen all day? No. Crazy. It's amazing. So we're going to take it back to the top of the order for attempt number three. Front 180, not hanging on. She went for it there. Jamie Kutcher. Oh, oh 360, 360 flip. flip. She was closer down the stairs. Well, she made that first 360 flip down yeah. the stairs in the first run. All right, next skater in, Megan Guy. Ah, oh, kickflip gets away kick from her Kickflip getting away. Dang it. Dropping in next, what she got for us after that massive switch ollie down the set. Big front 180. Very nice. Using her regular stance. All right, 10.71, so that's going to drop her lowest score to 7.79. Jordan Pascal in next. Oh, oh, that feeble once again, just not quite getting the height she needs. That's a risky one. And that brings us to Poe Pinson. Get him, Poe. Looks like she's gonna go back at the rail. Oh, oh man! I wanna see that front that. tail baby so it. bad. <laughs> All right, Samaria so Brevard on course. Oh, wow. Go for the Nolly God, heel. Nolly heel. Mariah Duran almost 100 points ahead of second place right now. Front front board attempt. Selena coming in. Oh, oh landing a little yeah. bit too much. Just a little oh, under-rotated there. Yeah. Oh, oh going for the 360 flip. Just getting away from her every time. Next skater in, Megan Guy. Last couple tries, let's see if she makes it. There it is. Oh. To see Hard from here. I don't know if there was drag, any touch but, uh, or not. We'll see where the judges go. 6.54. That's got her in fourth place overall. So the judges did score it. Paige Hine dropping in. 
All right, Paige with a backside board slide down the rail. Paige currently in fifth place. Next skater in, Jordan Pascal. Yeah, we saw Jordan with that feeble 50-50. Let's see what she's got here. And she pulled oh, that people down the big rail. For it. Oh, man. She's got one more try to pull that. Next skater in, currently in third place with a 93.37, but going for this front tail. Oh, oh man! Okay, let's see where Samaria out. sits. Oh, ah, Samaria Brevard going for the Nolly heel this flip. So much power there. Ah. This is one more always try. where it kills one me, more man. Try. And Mariah, is she going to go for the kick from the front board again? Looking so good on her board right now, man. Yeah. Wow. Selena in for her last oh, attempt. Nice. Yes. What the baby? Fakey. All right. Very nice. Very clean. All right. Eight point seven five. All right. Stays in sixth place. Next in, Jamie Kutcher. Come She's on, in. let's see the three in flip. Ah, oh, oh. so close. You know what though? Awesome that Jamie made it in. Yeah. Is out here from Florida. She stuck with her guns, man. In. What you got? The switch bonus. 180 down the big set. Yes. We'll take it. Down the eight stairs. That was nice. 7.94. Okay, so improving her lead right. over Paige, but still in fourth place, unable to crack in. But Paige right here. She's coming in. Fast. Switch. High oh, speed. The switch, switch 180. 180. Is that going to be enough to outdo Megan Guy? All right, so scores in 8.35. It's not going to outdo it. Megan Guy in fourth place right now. Right, so Jordan, Jordan Pascal in next. She's, she's going to get gonna a go huge feeble, score feeble again. if she wants like a shot it. to move up. Oh, oh man, I wish she was able to like make that feeble two drive. Away. You know what, though? Jordan as well, a so skater we're going to look out for. Such a future ahead of her. Great job, Jordan Pascal. Very commendable seventh place. All right, so now we're in our top three. I'm really curious to see where she goes with this right now. All right, so it looks like she's gonna scratch the tail slide fakie. I'm, yeah, I'm really curious else. to see what it's gonna be. Wow, Benny Benny Hanna. Hanna. <laughs> All right, scores in 6.32, and it actually pushes Samaria Brevard down into third place. Samaria so right now is just about a point behind Poe, yeah. but her lowest score is a 19.76, so she's got to she make this not yeah, heel for a shot. Make this. No! Oh, man! I heard the board, I heard the board break Breaks her board. One. Dang it. And that looks like that'll lock her in for third place for now. So yeah. Mariah Duran ending up in last third place. attempt, a victory lap, total victory lap, almost a hundred points ahead of Pope Henson. That was quite a showing for Mariah. There it is. Oh. Just amazing. That was, that was totally for the crowd. Yeah. Chris, look yeah. at those scores wow. right there. Wow. 190 <laughs> versus 99. 99. If that right there is not sending a message to yeah. all the women around the world <laughs> that says, hey, I'm coming for you in these Olympics, I don't know what does. And there you have it. Our 2021 USA Skateboarding Women's Street National Champion is Mariah Duran. A champion has been crowned. Now let's hop on over to CATF for our Men's Park National Championships. Welcome everybody to the CATF in beautiful Vista, California. Home to both our men's and women's 2021 USA Skateboarding National Park Championships. We've already seen some amazing skating. We've crowned our 2021 Women's Street Champion, Mariah Duran, but now it's time for the Men's and Women's Park National Championship. Let's do this. So I'm Josh Dirksen and we're here at the CATF. I'm going to give you guys a little preview of the course. First off, we got the big extension. It's, I think, 10 feet. <laughs> Gives you speed for the box or whatever else you want. Then we got the bank extension. 
And then here we got the fly box, kind of like the center feature of the park. Connects all the lines, you can hit the hips or do tricks all the way over, and it sets you up for the deep end. So here's uh, like the medium pool coping section, a little bit mellower tranny, so you can get like pretty tech. The quarter to banks, there's a smaller quarter there and a bigger quarter on the other side, so you can transfer onto the bank from both ends. The deep end, it's uh, nine and a half feet, I believe. You can gap up into the deep end or just skate it as like a face wall and hit the corners. Over here, we got just a variety of different, slightly smaller transitions. This is just also kind of in the center of the park. You can gap up from the spine area onto the bank. Over here, we have the love seat. Last but not least, we have the Marseille hip, which is just a six foot hip and can pretty much do whatever you want with it. <laughs> That's the CATF Park Bowl. This contest will be three, 45 second runs, best run counts. Let's take a look at the men's park lineup. Hamana Reynolds is going to be sitting this one out, had a little bit of a knee injury, so he's not going to be skating. Let's get this party started. Leading us off is going to be Tate Carew. Tate Carew, and I'm from San Diego, California. I think that skating this contest will set me be that much closer to making the Olympics. It would be super sick to win and be crowned the national champion. Welcome back, everyone, to the 2021 USA Skateboarding National Championships. It's the men's park final, and Tate Carew is dropping in. Starts off with that 360 over the volcano. Huge body jar there. Latest body jar ever. Yes, as we are talking, Andrew, Tate Carew is putting together an amazing line so far. There's that kickflip oh, snail fish. Oh, he hangs it. onto it. Wow. Off with a bang, dude. Goes. Wow. Very Indy. Tate Carew getting us started here. 15 seconds on the clock. 70.29, he is in the top spot. That is the score to beat. That's a, that's a proper score to start things off. Yeah. And as you said, three runs. I'm hyped. This is scored, action packed. Scored from zero to 100. So lots of room for growth right there for everyone, but a really good first run. Next skater in from Portland, Oregon, we've got Kevin Kowalski. I'm gonna go ahead and call Kevin a bona fide park terrain legend. This guy nice is a Gito Air. Method over the hip. Nice body jar. And Kevin's just been destroying transition contests for a decade now. Nice frontside invert on that extension. He's, he's always had a really cool bag of tricks. Yeah, unique. You can just tell he skates the, the, the skate parks in Oregon. Has great flow. Uh, how do you wrap around? I don't even see anybody do that trick anymore. Kickflip Indy. This is a great run for Kev Kowalski. Showing the young guns what's up. You know what I love? He up does something deep. on every obstacle. Up that disaster, up, up that extension, excuse me. That was just crazy. Kevin Kowalski, put your hands together. Wow, that was amazing. Oh, so, man. That proper right there. run for a proper legend right there. All right, scores are in, 57.72. Next skater in, Tristan Rennie. And Tristan was our 2019 National Championship finalist winner. And so uh, let's see what he's got for 2021. Oh, look, look at that. that. Speed Smith grind, a 5-0. Oh! Andy back to into the back lip slide. This is insane. Front side, plus side, through the corner. I love that he's smiling, too. <laughs> oh, he, 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 he owns, feels confident. He owns this part. Ah, Ollie to truck bash there. Floating front side Ollie into the bank wall. Oh, oh hanging on man, to that he held on to that so well. So smooth. 
Get him, Tristan. I love that transfer. That's really cool. A couple seconds. Final trick here. Oh, oh. Four. He just gets away from him. This is a really, really rad group of finalists. We've got some unique bags of tricks. I'm actually really excited about this next guy, Josh Dirksen. He is like a gladiator. This dude skates like Thor. Yeah, I call him Thor. And you'll see why. He's literally about to beat the park up. <laughs> so Look much speed. Stuff. Oh my god. Oh! Wow. Oh, he went down really hard right there. We got the medical staff checking on him. Tough as nails. He looks like he's in pain. That, that, we never want to see that one, man. for any of the skaters. I mean, wow. he was going so I'm fast just glad he's and okay. so huge. Head high on that huge bank wall. You called him a warrior for a reason, dude. <laughs> I said warrior. he was going to beat the park up, and then he literally <laughs> like came in and was like, yeah, elbow he's, park. He still won, though. He, All right, next he skater in. Away. We got Rafael Ueda, son of the legendary Lincoln Ueda. Look at that lace shove it. That was an amazing wow. transfer. Oh, man. like his pops right there, Lincoln Ueda. Known for his amazing, lofty oh, ass. Raphael, that nose grind transfer over the spine. Nose grind in the hip. Oh. Nice Look at how ollie. casual that was. So that novel 180 was like amazing. Half cab. Side flip just hovered over it. Wow, that was a That's, very, yes. very impressive first run for Rafael Ueda. Yeah, Ralph got third in our semifinals, and, and you see why. All right, so Rafael gets a 61.54 on run number one. Respectable, that moves him into second so far. So Tate Carew still in that top spot with a 70.29. Kevin Kowalski right now in third with a 57.72. But next in, we've got Jagger Eaton. And uh, yeah, this, this is going to be thrilling. We've been watching him practice. His line is no joke. Nice ollie over the spine. You know, we, we haven't really talked a lot about it today, but this Front is. What on that massive extension? Into the back 180 over the volcano. Switch ollie. Blind side switch Ollie there over the gap. Nice back spin. Speed check. Back tail every time. Woo! Back lift through the corner. He's got so much control. Alley of cap, half cap. to qualify for the Olympics. Yes. And that is a super important piece of Jagger's story because that man <laughs> wants to go to the Olympics. Well, he has been yes. born and bred to for get this. there. Exactly. Scores in 75.52. Oh. Jagger Eaton now in the top spot. Yes. And take Crew down in second. Points. But that is, I think that's just the tip of the iceberg oh, yeah. for Jagger. He's got way more in the back. All right, well. We're going to go to Liam Pace from Tucson, Arizona. Liam has a great bag of tricks. Skates yes. super fast. He goes huge. I'm excited to see what he brings to yes, the park. This is, this is our first place semifinalist. And we're going to see why right now. Nice 5 0 off the spine. So comfortable. This is insane. He's transferred right here. Huge. Oh, that was amazing. Over the entire bank wall. This fly out. Oh my gosh. That was that was right at the top oh, of the coping. Oh no! Uh, I'm gonna break this table in half. <laughs> wow. He's got Man. two more chances to put it all together. We've seen the lines. Well, okay, so that right there, that is exciting. He had a tiger by the tail, man. <laughs> Showing us why he qualified first in the semis. But we'll Let's see. take it back to the top of the order. Right now, 
Tate Carew currently in second place with a 70.29, scored a beat with Jagger 75.52. But this is only run number two, and we're gonna have a, another one after that. Here we go, Tate Carew on course. Massive stale fish. I love the tweak on that. 5-0, up the extension through that corner. Al you Andy. The way he boned that out was <laughs> unbelievable. What? Nice back set, Ali, keeping his speed, keeping things moving. Nice back set, Ali, there. 360 over the volcano. Oh, wow. So, that yeah. was a good run, but it kind of looked like he got lost a little bit, a little and bit, he was a little feeling, bit. A, he was, you could see that speed kind of wavering. Yeah. I see Score that. is in, and we are getting a 65.91 judges. Recognize that in there. You're going to stick with that first score, but he's got one more attempt left. Next in, we're going to bring in Kevin Kowalski, a certified veteran out here. Not super old, but man, he's been doing it for yeah, a long he, he's time. He's been doing this for a decade or more. Huge judo hair. Let's see if he changes up his line. Kevin currently in fourth place. So you know he wants to improve on that score. Nice foot plant there. Into the front side invert on the extension. Smith grind up that escalator. Get him, Kev. This is looking a lot like the first run. Let's see if he changes things up. There's that alley -oop saran wrap. Into the kickflip Indy. All right. Into the line. What's he got for us? Nice back, Smith. Oh, oh shit. Oh, the tail grab. Tail grab. Uh, I like it. He had a little, tried to add a little difficulty there at the end of the line. Scores in 54.55. He's going to stick with that first run score. Look to the third run. Next skater in. We've got. Tristan Rennie. Coming in with some serious speed. I love the speed, speed on that Smith he drive. He just looks so comfortable on the pool ah. Back them through the corner. There's that front one slide every time. Oh, I to love tail. That. He's got to try to find time to get to that 540 at the end of his line. Oh, the tail bash on the pole. Yeah, Tristan. 15 on the clock. 5-0 off the spine. All right, here we go. This is that 540. Oh, just got away from him. I want him to make that so bad. He's got one more. He's, he's, he's going to put it, it down. Yeah, I'm just putting that energy that. out there into the universe. Yeah. Lots of PMA. Yeah. All right, next skater in, Josh Jerkson. Man, he went down super tough in the last one. Yeah, I, I can't believe this I love it. The crowd's fired yeah. up. They want to see it. Yeah, Josh. Animal. It didn't slow him down. Huge Smith grind. right there, but he's still trying Andy. to go for it. Yeah, I mean, how do you do that trick again, head high, after slamming as hard as he slammed in the first run? He's just built like out of rock or something like that. Thor. I love it. Next skater in, though, really excited to see what he brings, Rafael Ueda. Yeah, eased his way into third place without a whole lot of effort. So let's see what he's got for run number two. He's just got such cool style. He looks so Everything's comfortable. Casual. Oh, that late shove it. Wow. I love seeing young dudes pick up tricks like late Look shove Look at that. Alley Green with so much style there. He is just flowing. There's that nose grind over the spine. He's gonna try to make it to that kick flip, I bet. Nose grind into the hip. Back tail. Oh, 
clip. Oh, I hit. want him to make that so uh, badly right here. He gets it all together and makes that or the front side clip at the end of his line. Third runs. Everyone's going to make them. We're just we putting want. it out there. We want it. We're putting it out there. All right. Either. Next skater in, coming out of Mesa, Arizona. We got Jagger Eaton. Jagger is currently in first place with 75.52. We saw an amazing, amazing first, first run. run. I'm excited to see yeah, where he goes and, from here. And Jagger is so strategic. You know he's got more gas left in the tank. He's gonna surprise us with something. Look at that, no handed. 360 three. over the volcano. He came in very hot on the yes. last one. Saw him miss it on the nose grind. He's got to put it all here. together. Get him, Liam. Nice Smith grind off the extension there. Massive stale fish. Nice 5 0 off the spine. Picking up a lot of speed right here. There's that transfer without grabbing his board. Massive back to Ollie. Oh, there's that fly Jeez. out. Could that be any higher? He swapped it out right there. He went front feeble instead. Uh, nice body jar. Got to stay on here. Add something. 50 50 to Fakey. What's he got? Oh! If he can do oh. that, it's gonna legitimately be explosive. Yeah, yeah, that, that will give Jagger 75.52 a run for its money. Oh, and Liam moves up in a third place with a fall. That's right. Take Karu looking to take Jagger Eaton out. Can he do it? So we need a new line. Starts off with that 360 over the volcano. Huge body jar there. Flip slide up Love the extension that. and through the corner. 5 0 on the spine. Oh, no! the kick was stale. One of his most consistent tricks. So that means Tate will have to be comfortable with second and lots of skateboarding left. So we'll see if he holds on to that spot. My next in, Kevin Kowalski. Kevin is currently down in fifth place. High score was 57.72 on his first run. Kev with that big judo air. And that backside air. So he's stuck with the same line. See if he can add in that pop shove and tail grab at the end. Nice frontside invert every time on that extension into that Smith grind up the escalator. Light clockwork, that lean air transfer. It's an alley oop saran wrap. Trick you used to see in the 80s comedy. going to do it for Kevin Kowalski. Fifth place is going to be where he stays. Yeah, that's uh, that's a bummer, but hey, he skated so amazing. Always loved watching Kev flow through the bowl in the parks. All right, next skater in, we've got Tristan Rennie. Tristan is down in six. Like you said, he was our champion in 2019. Yes. He said, and we've seen him fall on twice fire in on that 2019. He's got to get to that 540. He's got to put it down. Coming in very fast. Every time. In the air. To bash. Disaster. Front blunt 
slide to the corner like clockwork every time. Regular blunt slide, that's, that's a new one for this line. There's that tail bash on the tail bash. 5 0 to tail. Big Ollie, 15 seconds on the clock. Tristan has to get to that 540. It all comes down to this. Can he do it? And he does it! Yes! <laughs> oh, and the kick oh, flip! Okay, okay! At time! Things just got wow. interesting. So, <laughs> he pulls it. 75.52 oh. is the score to be. Amazing how he bailed that 540 twice and then throws in a kickflip in the immediately after he lands it. That's confidence though. He was like, <laughs> I got it and I know I can do this. Tristan score in 72.6, right. right. now in second place. He bumps right. Tate Carew down into third and Liam Case is outside of our top three. Next in, we've got Josh Dirksen. We'll see if he goes for that run again. Yes, we've only got three skaters that can unseat Jagger Eaton at the moment. Josh Dirksen is one of them after that intense slam. I He's a warrior. Everyone in here is so fired up for him. I love the speed. So he fast. He's going for it. There yes! It is. That's why. Seven seven six going to get him down to the seventh place, but I just really hope that there's a lot more of Josh Dirksen to come for the next yes, forever. Yes, yes, and we've forever, got two please. skaters that could potentially unseat Jagger Eaton. One of them is Rafael Ueda. Currently in fifth place, high score is a 61.54, but if he wants to get in that top three, it's going to take a 70. That late shot that he's got so wired, that is such a difficult trick. There's Look that quick tail grab. The style. Oh, no! The alley of lean gets okay. away from him. So, okay. Rafael Ueda, not going to improve on that fifth place. We have two skaters left, one of them currently in first, the other currently in fourth. And you know so, how Jagger skates. He's going to try to create more distance between I'm, himself and Liam Pace. I'm so excited to see what Jagger brings. I feel like no matter what, what we're about to see is the hardest they can do. <laughs> Get him, Jagger. All right, Jagger is in. Full no head at 360 over the volcano into that Look back nose blind. The confidence, that's what screwed him up on his last run, and he just dominates it. Gets the right amount of speed this time. Nose grind faking. You don't see anyone do that trick. Oh! And he misses the coping right there. Yeah. Honestly, just very uncharacteristic. Jagger. Yeah, and that opens the door for our last competitor, Liam Pace. Oh man, okay, it all comes to down to this. Again, this is for Olympic qualifying points. So even if he can't take out Jagger, getting onto that podium is it's super gonna make a difference. Important. So, without further ado, Liam Pace, run number three. Can he do it? Score to beat 75-5-2. Massive stale fish into that 5-0 off the spine. Getting all that speed for that Look huge at that back to the Ollie transfer. So much speed right now. And then that huge frontside wall jam every single time. High speed beams. All right, this is where it really matters. What's he got? He's got to make this. And he can't do it. That means that Jagger Eaton is going to be our 2021 USA Skateboarding National Champion. Oh, amazing. Jagger Eaton is Eaton doing it with a first run. The first run. Score of a 75.52. Put wow. that much distance between himself and the rest of the competitors. Oh. Skated with 
speed, confidence, difficulty. He was unfadeable. Here at the 2021 USA Skateboarding National Championships presented by Toyota, the finals fueled by Got Milk. We're going to take a quick break, but we'll be right back with the 2021 USA Skateboarding Women's Park National Championships. Stick around. Congrats to our women's street and men's park champions. Now, before we get into the women's park final, we've got the presentation of our 2021 USA Skateboarding National Championships of Fingerboarding presented by Tech Deck and judged by Mariah Duran, Samaria Brevard, Tori Pudwell, and Daewon Song. Check this out. Yeah, dream on. <laughs> From a moment. <laughs> it's so tough with this because being on the outside for me is like not really being able to fingerboard that well, but trying to learn and get better overnight, hopefully. So we got eighth place, classy fingers. And seventh place, FB Doom EQ. Sixth place is Dahlia Lundquist. And fifth place is Boredom FB. Good job, you guys. Fourth place is the Secret Tech Deck. And then third place is Fingerboard Slow Motion. One thing, half gap clip, back gap clip, look at this. Wow. Thank, you, thank you for a quick fake clip. Second place, Ridge FB. Oh, wow. Damn. Pump that first trick for sure. The flip from. Oh, that's not so fake. Oh, yeah, announced it like. Announced it like. <laughs> Yeah, that's pretty gnarly. Seventeen tricks total. Oh my god, that was. Kick the five roll, kick the pump, switch big flip front board. I'm out. First place, sorry for fingerboarding. Oh dude, this guy easy. I've seen this one. Look at the filmer. Shout out the wow, filmer. Wow, wow, wow. Making this homie look great. Yeah. It's, if you have a cameraman that's doing it right, too, it hooks you up. This dude's got his own gear and everything. Oh my god. Oh, yeah. Wow. Five oh, Tori. Oh, he, Tori, he did your, you know, I seen, remember your back 5 0 kick yeah, with back lift down that one? Sick. Uh, in Copenhagen, on the five -0. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Oh my god. He did a laser at the end. Everyone killed it. Congratulations. Filmer, thank you too. He hooked you up. All right. And there is your 2021 USA Skateboarding Fingerboarding National Champion presented by Tech Deck. And now it's time to get right into our women's park competition. Now let's take a look at the women's park lineup. this party started. Leading off is Grace Marhofer. Grace Marhofer and I'm from Cocoa Beach, Florida. I just want to go out there and have some fun. If I won, I, it would be unbelievable. Yeah. <laughs> so stoked. First skater in, we've got Grace Marhofer. My name's Grace Marhofer and I'm from Cocoa Beach, Florida. I just want to go out there and have some fun. If I won, I, it would be unbelievable. Yeah. <laughs> Get him, Grace. Nice eggplant. Wow, she has gotten so much more powerful since 2019. That's right, the last nice time we were in this room was 2019 in October. 
Nice, method over the hip there. Grace is cruising, nice frontside tuck knee. And it was big old Smith grind. 50-50 to Fakie, that's scary in a slippery ball. Good buddy. Yeah, Grace. So that, uh, to me, that seemed like contest strategy. It, it's still going on, but she's kind of getting one in the books. Slob fast player on the extension. Wow. That was great. Dude. A full All right. Five. Really well done. It kind of had everything. Yeah. The only, the, honestly, the only thing that was really missing was any flip tricks or like spins, but that was a solid park run. Scores in 43.06. That is the score to beat right now. Again, the format is three 45 second runs. Best run counts. This is so exciting. I'm Cody Tamanaha and I'm from Oahu, Hawaii. It would mean a lot because last year I came close to winning first, so if I got it this year, it'd be pretty cool. Everything's been taken care of properly, and it is so we rad to see skateboarding live. All right, Cody Tamanaha is in. Nice frontside air over the box there. Smooth Smith form, Smith grind. Nice frontside air on her toes. Coming from Hawaii. Deep to Fakey. This is a smooth run so far. Oh, oh no! I saw her make that back lift every single time in practice. She's got two more runs to make it happen. Their score is in for Cody, 21.63. She's going to try to improve on that, obviously. But um, yeah, it's been two years, and everyone's gotten so much more powerful. It's amazing. Case in point, Ruby Lily. My name is Ruby Lily, and I'm from Oceanside, California. What it would mean to be the <laughs> Women's Park USA National Champion, I'd probably just cry, <laughs> honestly. About to drop in. Ruby is awesome. I'm so excited to see what she brings in the run. Nice method over the box. You know, another method air. Nice lead the tail. That extension is no joke. Nice board to Smith over the spine. Lead disaster. Great line so far. Nice oh, nose drive. Amazing, dude. That's no joke. I love that quick board slide. Look at how many tricks she's getting in right now. Yeah. Kirby is in it. And a nose grind. So much confidence on that. Nice trail slide. Back D, five seconds. That was Wow. I that was really that impressive. The, the best run of the day so far. And scores are in. 40.52 put Ruby in second place ahead of Cody Tamanaha so far. So Grace right now holding that top spot with a 43.06. That's the score to beat, but we've got Nicole Haas dropping it. My name's Nicole Haas and I'm from Stillwater, Minnesota. This is just like points to get forward to Tokyo, so that would be pretty cool. Like if the stars magically aligned, that would be cool. Dropping it right now. Ollies and lots of power. Nice backs and ollie over the hip. Oh. Ollie bails. You hit the coping slightly wrong and an ollie goes goes sour. Oh, yeah, she's got two more runs. That's not the Nicole House we are uh, expected to see. You can throw that one away and worry about the next two. Next skater in. All right, next skater in, Jordan Barrett. My name is Jordan Barrett, and I'm from Oceanside, California. That would be really amazing if I won. I'd be very stoked. Just to be crowned national championships would be pretty dope. Jordan has been absolutely ripping in practice. Yeah, she's got so much contest experience. It's going to be interesting to see what line she pulls out here for first run. It's, my guess is she's playing it smart. Going to try to have no bails. Nice oh. eggplant on the extension there. You know, backside air over the front box. You know, another backside air. Smack disaster. I love when people do those quick disasters. Ooh, that 5-0 just looks so sick. Ah, one got away from her. Still an amazing run. All right, next skater in is going to be Minnesota. My name 
is Miss Des and I'm from Petaluma, California. If I won this thing, um, I'd be really happy because I've been training here for like a few weeks now. I think I have what it takes. Always looks like she's having fun, also. Tail wrap over the box into a mute air. Nice combo there. Oh, Smith Bryan lip slide. That. that is that's difficult on a curve. I'm Bryce Wettstein and I'm 17 and I'm from Encinitas, California. If I won, I would definitely cry tears of joy again. Winning for me would be landing the run of my dreams. Yes, the one and only Bryce Wettstein. Bryce is amazing. Oh no! Well, I'm a huge Bryce fan. Yeah, she, her personality is so... Just, I can't even explain it. She's, She's so just creative. like the nicest person. Yeah, just a ring. Like, that's gonna be a low score. She'll yeah, look to those next two. two more runs and make it all happen. Next skater in though, our first place qualifier in the, the semifinals. Semi yeah. We've got Jordan Santana. I'm Jordan Santana and I'm from Houston, Texas. I qualified first going into the semifinals, but it's all gonna come down to the real contest in the finals here. She's looking really focused. Reaver. First time we've seen that one today. 
these are 10 some, seconds. These are some big walls in here. Oh, no! Air to fake it. Grab it, no. Right there at that the end. That is so hard. So there we go, Cody now 39. 39.01, so she's in gonna fifth. try to have a score with no falls. Next skater in, Ruby Lilly, currently down in fourth place with a 40.52. Great first run, so I'm excited to see, does she have more in the tank? Yeah, yeah, my guess is she does. She's from Oceanside, she skates this California skate park training facility, so uh, I think she's got lots of moves, moves left. Nice trail slide there. Nice method, high speed into the stale fish. Oh, that was rad, that was a cool transfer. grind there. It's crazy how comfortable she looks. There's oh. that backside nose grind. Ah. Got away no. from her on the flat. Wow. That is so hard. That is Hit a deep ball. end of a ball. Next skater in. right now. Jordan. Yeah, Jordan got Coming second in, in uh, the qualifying round, and she is no stranger to contests. Been following uh, Jordan around the globe with Vans Park Series. She's, she's got what it takes. She's got a lot of comfort when it comes to competition. Nice eggplant there on the extension. Uh -huh. Backs that arrow with a box and a method. Big disaster. There's that one. There we go. We got away from her in her first run, and she's got the confidence nice. to pull the tail fish. About 10 seconds on the clock. Get him, Jordan. Nice frontside ollie. No grind revert. Oh, 5 0 grind revert is no joke in that corner. Improvement. All right, to get into our top three right now, score to beat is a 43.06. To take the lead, it's a 57.62. We'll yeah, see if that's enough to say, get her man, up this, there. This competition is stacked. Anyone, any one of these women can win this thing. Look at that, scores in 46.61, moving Grace Marhofer down into fourth. Jordan Turn Barrett now in third, third place. Yes. But it is far but from over. not satisfied. She far wants to have a run without a fall. All right, Minna Stess in for run number two. I love that tail grab into the mute air. So Minna in second place right now. There's that 55. Smith lip slide. Yeah, I wonder if she's got anything she's holding out on. Well, like you mentioned, run. that kickflip. We want to see that kickflip. I think she's setting up for it. There it oh, is! There we wow. go! full-blown street kick flip, That was too. proper. Super good flick. Amazing, amazing. We, we wondered if she was going to add some difficulty, and she did. There's a Smith grind revert. Stay on. Fakey oh, no one. Oh, I love it. Yanking it in. Wow. Oh, All right, a yes. solid second run. I, I was sweating on that rock and roll because often that's what happens. You go through I an amazing know. run and you bail on a rock and roll. What Stayed a great on, run perfect right run, there. kick flip on the wall. That is going to give Jordan Santana a run for her money. Ooh. Ten minute do it. Yes, she does with a 59.02, pushing Jordan Santana down into second place. And Minnesota is now your current leader. 
Next in, we got Bryce Wetstuff. She is just so fun to hang out with and skate. I want to see her do well in this competition. Get it, Bryce. There we go. What's that backside air? Gap. 50-50 to fake, and she's got those dialed. Yes, cabin to the bank wall. Floaty backside ollie there. Nice toe going on right there. It was amazing. Nice people grind fakey through the corner. Into the fakey nose. Hey, that was awesome. It was almost alley oop. Yeah, Bryce. Back disaster. Bolus D. Oh, and the 50 50 Reaver. And there we have it. Oh, the body burial. Grab tail to disaster to end things. And now that. Bryce Wettstein run. That's I am the run we were looking for. Yes, yeah, she does. Into third place, 53.85. Bryce is now in third, pushing Jordan Merritt down into fourth. Yeah. I am so excited, though, because Jordan Santana now coming in as our last skater in run number two. We saw Jordan come in hot yeah, with that Jordan 540 came in last hot time. 540 right off the bat. How's she going to improve on that? Oh, you! Look at that! Lip slide through the corner. Into a big board slide. It's like watching Steve Caballero. Oh, no! People grind. Gets oh. away from her. That's going to put a lot of pressure wow. on her for that last run. Yeah. And this is, we got a contest on our hands because the point differential between Minna, Jordan, and Bryce is not very big. Right now, Grace Marhofer about to drop in. She's currently in fifth. Needs to crack 53.85 to get in our top three. Can she do it right here? Stalled eggplant. She like, she stalled that. She was up there. Backside Ollie into the bank wall. You know, a mess there. I love how she tweaks those out over the hip. Zach gets the front side air, smacking down the tail with authority. Nice miss grind through the corner. Into a 50 50 fakey. She's got to make this last trick there. Oh, yes! there's the fakey 50. Yeah, that's what she lost on uh, the previous run. Pulls it. She's got five seconds. One more move. Let's see it, Grace. Oh, the slap plant on the I extension. I think that one's going to count. Oh, wow. Trying to beat that 53.85 to get in the get top three. In the top three, exactly. Will it happen? And score is in 44.7. It's an improvement, but it is not enough. Next in. Cody Tamanaha for run number three. Currently down in eighth place with a 39. Yeah, Cody's She's got to put got it together. The moves. She's just got to stay on. That great style. Love that tuck knee over the fun box. Nice Smith grind. There's that front side air we love every Looks single so time. Cool. Feeble faking. She's definitely got to step up the difficulty from the first two runs. There's that back lip through the corner. That's no joke. Nice port side to the opposite corner. Smith Grind Reaver. Super well done. She's got the fakey D. She's got to add something difficult right here. There it is. There's that nose grind, nose grab and air transfer. Into the fakey oh, shove it. we were looking for, that's definitely going to step her up from her eighth placing. Okay, we're waiting on that score. Man, that fakey shove it, rock over. 41.48, it's going to move her go. up into seventh place. Oh, Ruby Lily correct. now down in eighth place. But Ruby is coming in for her third run right now. Ruby Lily is in eighth place. She's got to change up that line she's been doing. Nice big backside air. That stale transfer. That is a cool transfer. With that pole right there, it's so sketchy. Nice 5 0 grind. There's that back nose grind. Look at that. Wow. Nice really 
probably going to need to go for yeah, it right she's, here. Yeah, she's not yet utilizing every wall, which I think is hurting her scores. Oh. You know, this, so although the women are making it look easy, this park is huge. It's this, big. It's the big. deep end is and, deep. And you can't have any just cars through the corner. You got to hit the coping every wall. Yeah. Back to back tricks like we're seeing from our top three. So, Ruby's gonna stay in eighth place, and we are moving down the list. Nicole House from Minnesota. Yeah, I really hope she can stay on and put it down. Right now, down in sixth place, her highest score is a 41.68. But Nicole can do it. If she can put it all down, coming out of Stillwater, Minnesota. Nice 5 0. There's that. Whoa, oh, that was amazing. Value back that Ollie. <laughs> that is such a risky, difficult trick. Especially in a contest. Huge floater Ollie over the volcano. Uh, get it to Oh, back lip got away from her. You know, I'll just take a replay of that alley oop Ollie. Please. She's always on the highlight reel. It's like. Next skater in, we've got Jordan Barrett. Jordan, right now in fourth place, trying to get in the top three. The score to beat 53.85. Nice Can she do it right here? Speed. Go and listen to that frontside air. Jordan skates with so much authority. Eggplant on the extension. Oh, no! Uh, she gets she gets over the volcano, and then the, the regular backside air gets away from her. Jordan you know will likely be sticking with our fourth place scores. But. For the first real competition in over a year, everyone is skating phenomenally. And man, great, great, great skating by Jordan Barrett. It's, it comes down to a battle between Minna Bryce and Jordan right now. Oh. So we'll see what Minna does, and then she's going to have to sit and wait. Yeah, so Minna currently in first, as you mentioned, 59.02. That's Love that. She's gonna try to create some distance between her and Jordan, Jordan Santana. Eyes B50. Setting up for the kickflip. There it is. Yes! Oh, it down. Every time. And that kickflip is the reason she's in first place right now because that is such a difficult trick to do on a huge bank, bank wall like that. Nice. Hampered on the extension there. That gap oh, to look board. at the way she sucks her legs so up when she does that. It's high awesome. speed. Wow. Oh, all right. All so right. so we saw a repeat of that run. Yeah, same run. I don't know if we're going to see an improvement on the score. Exactly. Yeah. But we've got really two more well skaters. Done. Jordan Santana currently in second, and Bryce Westheim currently in third. Bryce Wettstein coming in next, currently in third place with a 53.85, less than five, less than six points in between first and third. Can she do it? We saw a great second run. Bryce is on course. Nice backside air there. 50-50 to Fakey. There's that cap into that bank wall every time. Alley of back D. Get him, Bryce. The oh, lip side Smith grind. I love so that. So much authority. Little people faking. Nice back to Ollie. 15 on the clock. Oh! I did not <laughs> see that coming. Finger flip. Wow. Stay on, Bryce. Stay on. Oh, and that is time. Wow. Okay, that Perfect just got run. saucy. Uh, and the note one after time. Just wow. The she just wow. had one. Oh, my God. I got to say, that was finger flip. That was huge. It, it was big. I mean, it was, oh, it was the size of a regular waist high homeless. All right, and hold to, on. Here. To jump into that wall. Score to beat 59-02. Bryce, can she do it? Surprising. Score is in 51.73. So that is not gonna do it. 
and it all comes down to this right here with Jordan Santana. And he's got a target on her back, but as of right now, she's in the top spot. Can Jordan do it? and more but we still have one more event for the evening let's take it back to downtown LA to the barracks for the men's street final summer is here and with a great deal on a new Toyota you can go out and enjoy all your favorite summer sports like softball Beach volleyball, triathlons, woo, racing, golf, whoa, someone needs lessons. What makes an amazing deal even better? How about that every new Toyota comes with Toyota Care, a two year or 25,000 mile no cost maintenance plan with roadside assistance. Get your Toyota today. Toyota, let's go places. Welcome back everyone to the 2021 USA Skateboarding National Championships presented by Toyota, the finals fueled by Got Milk. And now all we have left, Andrew, is our men's street championships. But before we get into it, USA Skateboarding put together an amazing piece on a very inspirational skater, Richie Batris. Hi, my name's Josh Friedberg. I am the CEO of USA Skateboarding and we're here today to talk with Richie Batris about transgender skateboarders. Richie. Hi. <laughs> it's nice to finally meet you. Thank you, Josh. So you heard about the contest, you filmed your line, you submitted it for the women's division of the national championship street contest. Tell me a little bit about that moment that you, you pressed submit. That, that's funny because that is the moment where it all kind of came to me. And it wasn't up until I got my line, I almost choked. I was like, I'm, I'm not gonna do this, guys. Like, that's when I kind of figured it out. It was like, oh, this is kind of out of, out of the natural, I guess it's against the grain in some sort of way. I almost didn't do it, but I just, uh, I just knew it was right. When I got the entry and I saw it come in, we haven't had to have a process in place for transgender skateboarders yet. You're the first one that's, that's entered a contest that we have sanctioned. Um, so I had to really sit down and figure out what, what that process was. And I reached out to you. I just said, Richie, I really appreciate you entering the contest, but I don't know what what the rules are right now and I need to figure that out. So I talked to the United States Olympic and Paralympic Committee to get advice on what to do in this situation and talk to other national governing bodies. And then I was able to kind of get to what appeared to be the best way to determine the path forward, which is the, the current International Olympic Committee rules on transgender athletes in Olympic competition. How did you feel when, when I hit you back and I said, these are the rules, there's some specifics that we have to follow because of where we are in the Olympic movement. There's a lot of excitement, but a lot of fear because of the, the nature of it. I, I thought I had it, you know, like I'd, I've never been asked to prove my femininity to anybody. Um, so I, I didn't think it'd be a problem. It wasn't until it was like time to get the tests to continue into the competition that I realized I wasn't gonna be able to. And that's kind of when I guess the feelings started. <laughs> at the end of the day, at USA Skateboarding, we work on the idea of skateboarding for all, and that doesn't have anything to do with gender. How do you express yourself alone when, you know, talk about the hiding and what and how you were hiding essentially? Rob. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. I mean, what, with whatever you're comfortable with, I mean. After intense qualifying runs in this division, our judges were able to narrow it down to our top eight. Jagger Eaton is not going to be skating the street competition today. Unfortunately, suffered an injury with the ankle. Here are your men's street finalists. Our 
2021 USA Skateboarding National Championships Men's Finals right now. Dropping in first will be Chris Jocelyn. My name is Chris Jocelyn and I'm from Hawaiian Gardens, California. Skateboarding being in the Olympics is amazing. The selfish part of me is also like, dude, if I could get in there and do good, it might just help out a little, so. I just saw Jocelyn doing some of the biggest backside flips I've ever seen at the barracks in practice, so I'm excited to see Chris drop in, and he is in. He's on course. First of two runs, big 180 up. I love watching Jocelyn's game. Nice switch tail there. Keeping it flowing. Now they front forward to fake it. Ah! Oh, he front way. Way. We'll take it. Man, we just got <laughs> control. He took it to fakey on that first one, and then you see him pulling off that half cab. He ended up in nose. He was trying to grow. Yeah, and there is no pauses in this line. It's just bang, bang, bang. That's how you have to skate the barracks. Very large, spread out course, and you got to fill it with tricks. Bangers. Like that. Huge big spin. That was a great, a nice little finale right there. Uh, big spin down the stairs. <laughs> and he's stoked. Yes. Score is in 54.95 for Jocelyn on run number one. My name is Mike Piwowar, and I'm from Chicago, Illinois. To be crowned the USA champion would be like a dream come true. I mean, it'd be, I don't want to say it'd be unbelievable, but it'd be, it'd be amazing. Mike Piwowar. He will war as a gnarly, gnarly raw street skater. Look at that, gnarly flip, no slide, <laughs> showing you. This dude takes it to the streets for real. Mike is a technician. Woo, switch tail, switch 270 out. It's a great line so far. Nose grind, bump to A-frame. Get it, buddy. I love the focus for <laughs> Nice crooked grind. 10 seconds. Let's see what he's got here. Wow. Going for a massive back 180. Got a little uh, wheel bite there, but still a great run for Mike. I'm Becker Dunn, I'm from Cincinnati, Ohio. I thought it'd be a good opportunity. I always thought if skating was ever in the Olympics, it'd be cool to try it. Becker was uh, impressive in practice. Nice high speed Smith grind. And the 5 0. Run Crooks down the big rail. Ah! Run Feeble gets away from him. That's such a tough one right there. When you're, when you're mid -time. Yeah, that, that fast too, man. Alright, coming in switch. Ah! Going for the switch front crooks. Not hanging with him. Ten seconds on the clock for Becker Dunn. Let's see if he can end with a bang here. Nice switch, Feeble. Scores in for Becker, 28.30. My name is Chris Pierre. I'm from Sleepy Hollow, New York. I just want to show out and show the world what I got, honestly, and see what happens from there. I'm about to have a baby right now, so I'm doing it for my baby. Chris came in and practiced just on fire. So I, I expect, uh, yeah, <laughs> I expect his run to be no different. He came in here heated. Nolly front nose. Back when he knows Brian, that is a hard trick in a contest. So much can go wrong. Oh, he's coming up. High speed. Top. Bank to flat. Massive 360 Ollie. No hesitation. Wall ride reaver. Yes, what a combo. Amazing. Seriously showing. He bombed out of the way up and just went for it. 270 out. <laughs> oh man, wow, that is nice. Dude. I can't wait to see that. That, that run. Uh, fall after time. That that took the gloves off. Almost 10 points ahead of Jocelyn. Amazing first run there. My name is Jake Alardi and I'm from Osprey, Florida. It'd be pretty cool to win this just to have that title. It would just be cool to be like the USA National Skateboard Champion. Got third in our semifinals. Get him, Jake. Nice one, 
knuckle grind. That is a long rail for that trick. Mach 360 flip. Yeah, Jake. I love the back lip. I love how Jake can skate everything, man. Transition, stairs, you name it, rails. Nolly nose grind. Speaking of rail skills, there we go. 15 seconds for Jake Alardi. <laughs> For sure. Nice recovery with the backsmith. Five out of Vicky. Time, but uh, yeah, that uh, lip was after time, so 51.94 gets him into third, third place. place. Tyler Peterson from St. Louis, Missouri. I'm feeling pretty good. I've never felt as good on my board as I do now. I'm just happy to be in the finals, so I don't really care what place I get. Tyler placed second in our online semifinals, so look out for this guy. This man has some tech moves. Nice solid tail slide there. Kick. Oh! Thought he had that. Stepped off late. Nice oh, recovery. Recovered it. <laughs> oh. That is so. I love cool. it. Wow. I speed. You ever grind a nollie flip? flip? I have not. <laughs> Neither have I. Nice frontside like flip, but got away from him. Yeah, I seen him bang that trick out in practice every single time. The makings of a great run if Tyler can put this all together. He's got plenty more contests left. Front rook nollie flip. Back to the makings of an amazing, amazing run if he can put that all together. I really hope he puts it together. Deshaun Jordan, and I'm from Chandler, Arizona. What it would mean to me to retain my title as the US champion, I would be super stoked on it. It would be important, you know what I mean, for me to just maintain where I'm at. Can he do it? He's sitting oh, ninth in our football I'm ready to find out. USA it's rankings. Sean Jordan. Wow, he sat on that overcrook. That was so tight. <laughs> the classic Deshaun 270 lip. And Deshaun's trying to better on his ninth place seating. Overall, wow. He just Front board up. That. that is a tall order. Switch from people down the big rail. That was amazing. Deshaun is on. <laughs> 15 seconds. Get him, buddy. Only up, super easy. Board slide up the rail. Dude, that is so good. Dude. <laughs> Seven. Yes. He takes the lead. One dive from a gold medal. Sometimes we're so focused on the destination that we forget to praise those who are with us on this journey. From the first stroke in the water the final stretch towards the finish line. From the drills at sunrise to the restless drop of sweat at twilight. We are not moving alone. And never will be. So this year is their year. We will run, swim, fight, ride, fall, rise, move, just for them, because we move as one. Welcome back everyone to the 2021 USA Skateboarding National Championships presented by Toyota. The finals fueled by Got Milk. Chris currently in third place after first runs. Chris is like a wrecking ball. He just comes in so hard. 180 up. That switch tail slide, 270 out. Uh. Get him, Chris. Honestly, everything that from from so much authority. Oh, there's that combo. 
Crooks is more solid this time. Nice front blunt on the quarter pipe. Boom, massive 360 flip. Up the step up. He's got 15 seconds on the clock. Five on a tail. I like that he yeah, got the Chris. Fred Gall moving. Spicing it up. Massive big spin. Sort of a contest make. Scores in 51. 51, yeah, yeah, just under that first run. All right, Mike, Mike Pivoir. Pivoir. Get him, buddy. On course for run number two. Is that Nolly Crooks? And the Nolly flip nose. Perfect again. So Blunt Fakie setting himself up. All right, coming in twist. Nice. The switch tail, 270. So smooth. That is not easy to do on a slippery indoor park floor, I will tell you. Solid nose grind every time. Get him, Mike. Nice crooked grind. 10 on the clock. There's a switch back, 180. Ah, that was a solid run. 106.81. And scores in with a 50.93. High speed Smith grind. In in the 5 0. Nice front crooks. Get him, beggar. Wow, there's that front feeble. 180's out. On the way up, it was like the scoop was incredible. And, and the dip on that front feeble. It's front drugs. Becker's putting it together. Ah, misses the switch feeble this time. I like the hustle. I know, I, I love that everyone is just like, I'm in. This is it. That's not. For the crowd. And he puts that all together. Next skater in, Chris Pierre Jacques coming out of New York City. Actually, upstate New York. Ooh, I love the grapefruit grind. That's a Chris Cole special. Style and authority, I love it. He's like levitating into that. Nice front blunt. High speed tail slide. Ah, he'll flip out just getting away from him. Got about 15 seconds left. Oh, he's going, he's going at the big three. Coming in, switch. Switch hard. I am so excited that like the switch hard flip is making a mega comeback right now. That is a good move. Chris sitting in fourth place right now. Huge 360 flip. And the 360 flip was in time. He's that up shoots in the top spot. Into first place. 50.83. Yeah. 15. Jake Lardy now on course for run number two. Dude, that long front feeble to start off his run that, is, that is, is wild. That is a crazy way to start a run. No! Uh, 360 flip got a little over rotated there. Got away from him. Look at that though. He didn't even go to the quarter pipe. He was like, no, I'm going to keep the sauce moving. Jake sitting on a score of a 51.94, trying to improve on that. Oh, smart move. He kind of had a Cut wobble, kick and he was like, nope. He bailed on the, uh, he bailed on the kick flip. It's a 5-0 fakey. Come on, get the cab back lift. There, oh, oh, a little bit of wheel bite. Barely no. not hanging on to that. Five seconds on the clock. Switch three flip. on this best trick format. He scores in 29 to 1. I'm going to keep him right. down and put him in fourth. But he's got five best tricks ahead of him. Next skater in, we've got Tyler Peterson. Yeah, Tyler can oh, put it all oh, together. Getting squirrely. Oh. So the new score to beat, Chris Pierre Jocks in first place with a 115.59. And Tyler bailing that kick foot back, back lip will have to rely heavily on our best trick format. But hey, anything can go. Four best scores, right? So it's all about your four best scores. That's all that matters. Absolutely.
Nice cross side flip there, hovering over the board. Ah, That's okay, we're gonna look to those best tricks. Front crook, nollie flip out every time in practice. Like you said, best trick. Plenty more contests left, anything can happen. As far as the leaderboard's concerned, he'll probably stick around down in seventh place, but you call we it. got seventh place. five best trick attempts left. So here we go, Deshaun Jordan, Dropping round number two. In. Ah, the way he Overcooked sits on that. The way he sits on it, so solid. Front 270, lip like it's nothing. He's got so much power. There's that front board up. Insane. Man, that switch from Feeble was so well ah. done. It just looks incredibly comfortable. There's the Ali up. Sticking with a lot of the same line with what worked the first time. Wait, awesome. So All right, with two runs under our belt, we're going to take a quick break, but don't go anywhere because we've got five best trick attempts coming up after this. Your invitation awaits. What the heck is this? You have been invited. Is this? Oh, it is. You are here. Are they doubling the bracket? If you choose to accept. That I do. Oh man, here we go again. Let's do this. Hmm, I wonder what that could be. Let's get back into the action. Chris Jocelyn starting it off, and he's going huge. Oh, there it is. Whoa! The biggest backside flip that in the building. Giant! Scores in 71. Uh, yes. That is huge. So that, that outdoes both of his first two runs. Yeah. We got ourselves That's a contest. That's our third highest score of the day, and you know that man is not done. Mike Pewar. He's got four more best trick attempts. Mike Pewar coming in switch. Oh, switch. Front Smith down the rail. That's a ballsy that's, move. I know, that's so terrifying <laughs> that's right move. there. So Mike Pewar scores in 52.39. Look at that, outdoing his run scores. He's now in third place with a 151. Yes. And our next skater in is Becker Dunn. It's a 25 point difference between Jocelyn and Pewar. What? He just did a pop shove in front feeble. Down the rail. I've never even I, seen I that. I know what I just saw. <laughs> Scores in 60.98. Coming in, Chris Pierre Jacques. One of my new favorite skaters. This dude is on fire. This guy has crazy pop, wild moves. Coming in, Nolly. This is hate to see him. I really hate to, hate see, to see that. Next skater in, Jay Gallardi. Coming in quick. I know what he's going for. I'm not going to tell you. Oh, totally spun out what I thought he was going to do. Big spin flip front board to Panky. I'm waiting that score. So, scores in 70.14. He is currently in fourth place. Tyler Peterson up next, going for that front crook nollie flip. Tyler Peterson not able to get that front crook nollie flip. Next skater in, Deshaun Jordan for his first attempt. On a round bar. The biggest handrail in the building. Woo! Oh, that is like an 80.82. Oh, my the God. He is up ahead. there. That was I guess that's how you skate a contest right there. <laughs> yeah, Chris Jocelyn, right now down in second place, quite a bit behind. Big spin. We saw the biggest big side flip. Now we just saw the biggest big spin. Wow. Jocelyn does those tricks. They're the biggest you've ever seen. It was so well right done. Right in front of your face. We saw that 71 on the first one. 72. Next skater in, Mike Pewar, currently down in third place. Looking to get a fourth score on the board. Exactly. We got it. Dude, he just, oh my god, he was so close to a switchback Smith. So we got to know Jocelyn in first, but he's the only person with four scores on the board so far. So things can shift a lot. All right, Becker done. Oh, oh, he went from trick. manual trick 
That is like very hard. No one likes doing manual tricks in contests. I'll just tell you that right now. Next skater in, Chris Pierre Jacques. Away from him. That's going to be zero for That's, him right yeah. there. Jake Olardi is going to attempt to chase Chris Jocelyn right now with this best trick score, number two. That's what I thought he was going for last run. Big spin front Big spin front the lines. It's a serious He's got three move. more tries for that. Next in, Tyler Peterson. Yes! I'm so glad he made that. There it is. You can see the pressure. He looks like he's so glad off he shoulders. made that. He's like, yeah, <laughs> thank you. All right, so we see a score of a 34.51. So it looks like he's going to have to step it up. Yeah. Next skater in, Deshaun Jordan. What the is he going to do? Hour. Grind up the hubba. the hubba. I know you called him human earlier, but I'm gonna debate that. A, a part of me thinks he might be superhuman. Chris Jocelyn coming in switch. Switch, heel flip, switch front board. Wow. You called it. You can get tech. This is and, amazing. And how solid he did that? That was wow. That was one of the best tricks of the day. Switch heel front board Ooh. down a rail. Uh, scores in 72.17, so he drops that 51.86. Jocelyn has the potential to win it in best trick. We still got two more right. tries after yes. this one, though. So Mike Pirouar coming in next, setting up switch, and coming at the big rail. That's going to hurt. Mike currently in third place, but that second zero is definitely going to hurt things. Becker Dunn is back in. Looks like he's coming for that manual. Done. <laughs> How did he do that? Watching Dude. him in oh the God. manual was like, that That control was that insane. That gave me so much like, appreciation for that moved. new skateboarding. 56.05. So, so now, that, yeah, that up in up third, third place, Mike Pierre got pushed down. Next skater in, Chris Pierre Jacques, coming in switch. It's Trey. Ah, attempt number three, we got Jake Alardi. He is coming in fast at that rail. There it is. Big spin front board. What? The big. Honestly, front board. Front this is face. absurd. Wow. Big spin front one. Currently in fifth place, and that's gonna jump him up into third, the 78. So two more tricks to make things happen. Yeah, he's place. looking good, man. I mean, the, they're closing the gap, that's for sure. His lowest score is a 29. Next in, Tyler Peterson. Whoa! Crooked run, Nolly 180 flip. So his last score, he got a 34.51. 40.91, judges gave it a little bit of extra oomph for the Nolly flip 180. All right, All right next back. in, Deshaun One Jordan. Last man in the order. I hope he does this Crook 180. Oh! There it is. Crook 180 off oh! the hub. It was so Into cool. Into that steep ass bank. He wow. made that look so easy. I'm clapping. That was so proper. For anybody watching this and going, <laughs> oh, that looks like easy. That was so hard. Let's see if that bumps him up in the first. Just 59. Deshaun now in the top spot. He's got his fourth score on the board and a commanding lead. Can he do it? Attempt number four. Jocelyn coming in with some speed. I don't know if he was going nolly heel crook or nolly heel board, but that was that would be a really big score. All right, Mike Piwawar coming in. There it is. Did you wow. see that? He His wheel definitely hit the rail. <laughs> he held on to Switch that. That was incredible. Smith. You guessed it. All right, 62.45. Look at him. He's now in contention with Jake Lardy. 214 points. He's closing that gap. Next skater in, Becker Dunn. Ooh. Also going for the big spin front line. Becker will take that as a scratch. Currently sitting in sixth place. Chris Pierre Next skater in. He's currently in eighth place. Chris Pierre Jacques, but he's coming in hot. That was a very large back three attempt. All right, 
Next yeah. in, Jake Alardi. Jake is in currently place. his lowest score to beat, 29.21. He has a lot of potential. Oh, he just did it. Kick the front blind. So, if this one's in the 70s, man, he really has an opportunity to close that gap. Scores coming in, Jake, 79. Next skater in, Tyler Peterson. He's coming in switch. Kicking out on the switch heel. Getting away from him. And Deshaun Jordan will be up next for his fourth attempt. Dude! Laser that was, flip. It was solid. like a yo-yo. He just like whoop, threw it out there and pulled it right back. 69.46. It gets rid of the 59. He's now at a 304. Man, that's a big lead. As of right now, Deshaun in the top spot, Jake Alardi in second, and Chris Jocelyn in third. Jocelyn, his lowest score is a 54.95. He's got to put something huge that. down right yeah. here. Can he do it? Coming in, Nolly. Uh, Nolly heel board, unable to make it happen, so third place is the best that we're going to see from Chris Jocelyn. But he's got some people nipping at his heels. Mike Pioir, right now, yeah. he's going to need a huge score. He's need, yeah, he's going to need something uh, off the chart. Oh, oh, nose grind, nollie <laughs> flip attempt. Had potential, but unable to put it down. That's going to do it for Pioir. And fourth is going to be the best he can do. Next skater ends, Becker Dunn. We saw him try that big spin front one on the last one. We'll see if he goes back for lost treasure. Props for, for trying to step oh, that I up right there. I wish it would have made that so much. That would have made things really interesting. Yeah, so that's going to do it for Becker. So Chris right. is yet to put down a best trick score, unfortunately. You've got to get those four scores on the board. That was a huge Massive back three. three. That's unreal. That was big. Yeah, making the East Coast proud and, right there. And look at those scores, man. 64, 50, all right, 70.44. Moves them up into fifth, which is great. With only, Good for yeah. him with only three scores on the board, too. It's all coming down to this for Jake Gallardi. He needs a really big score right now. What's he, he needs got? a 77.26. He's coming in switch. Oh, man, he put it all on the line. <laughs> Unable to make it happen, wow. so that means the best possible for him. Yeah. Second place. So we got all Tyler next. Peterson. This is a victory lap <laughs> and a repeat for Deshaun Jordan. Man. 2021 men's national street champion taking a victory lap. Coming in fakey. Oh! With the best fakey 360 flip I have I ever seen that. in my life. Deshaun Jordan just sent a message. Champion. Yeah, he just that sent a message. Is our national everyone. Mama, there goes that man. That was the 2021 USA Skateboarding National Championships presented by Toyota. The finals fueled by Got Milk. Congratulations to all of our champions here this weekend. From myself and Chris Pastris, thanks so much for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.